since 2015, we've printed over 500 unique hearts. This is not a textbook we're creating. Each heart has a story, has someone's child attached to it. Each heart that we've printed so far, we've used for surgical planning to not only visualize anatomy in a completely different way, but also to rehearse operations, to actually be able to touch children's hearts, to cut and sew children's hearts and tracheas and bones before we actually operate on the child. And it's a routine part of our workflow. People in our preoperative surgical conference will say, well, let's print a heart. We can solve that question by printing a heart. When you're touching the heart, when you're looking inside the heart, are answered immediately as to what you can do and what you can't do in a way that no 2D reconstruction, no visualization can do. Touching the heart, seeing the distance, seeing where stitches need to go is an enormously powerful technology and technique. Now I had been thinking about a, a different approach and this model has just changed my mind on that. For a patient to be able to look at a three-dimensional image of their own heart takes them to a different place, a different level of understanding, and it helps them become part of the healing process. They were empowered to participate in their care in an active fashion, to handle the heart, to touch the heart, to start those other pathways in their brain that we know are so important to helping plan, to helping visualize. The Stratasys J750 and J5 printers give us an unbeatable combination, a synergistic combination of printers that maximizes our workflow. In addition to the simpleware, AI and machine learning driven segmentation software, this allows our biomedical engineers to be effective and efficient in their work and produce the models that we do for our patients and families today. Even after 500 hearts, we're still learning the applications of 3D printing. We're embarked on a new proof of concept project where we're gonna be giving patients that we don't operate on models of their hearts for patient education to improve the entire patient experience. Again, this project would simply not be possible without the generous charitable support of our donors. The success of our 3D printed hearts program, 500 hearts later, has renewed our commitment to seeking new technologies, to seeking transformative technologies that are going to improve congenital heart care and improve the care of children and patients everywhere.